grab so easily. I like that. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I need with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. The aim. You look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And hold your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. I found that if I did, <clears> that, it's a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly. Yeah. And I'll cover your ears. <laughs> Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Steady now. Almost got it. Okay, a little higher. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Close. Now keep it steady. I got it! Excellent. Good shot. A little bit more to the left. You did. Good job. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See, you did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. hurt and my ears have noise in them like you'll get used to it what a crappy day the crappiest and three months ago i don't know what you'd be seeing i don't know if i would have taken you with me i probably would have run out of food you're damn near starved with me i'm glad i came with you so you're probably not gonna like this Oh no. What happened? <clears throat> Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. Okay. You know, we don't have to do this right away. Okay, good. It's a fifth of whiskey. A 
have found those scissors in your pack. Oh, good. Get to snipping. I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Suit yourself. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You don't know. Will do. <clears throat> hey, man. You and me, we, uh, oh, fuck it. Let's just get to the ocean. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. Doesn't matter a lick to me. Fuck. Just gotta move forward. Hey. Yeah? Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. Well, I'm if I get by you for a second, Kenny. Can you just leave me alone? Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. Thanks. It was me. Huh? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. right now and be done with it. No! I... Please, please! Why shouldn't I? They said they had my friend! I didn't know what to do! Please, please! I had to tell someone. I bet you did. Hmm. <laughs> And my parents were in Savannah. I know. Look. No, I don't care about safety. I care about finding them. Okay, we'll look for them. Really? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Gonna to want to look for a boat here, I imagine. And from there, we've got all the savannah to the southwest of us. Now we've got a good chunk of savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but 
Read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M M something Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it. So we'll head there. Yes. You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? <laughs> you know. They'll like it. Promise. Hey, Clint. Hi. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Nope, nope. It's a good thing. <laughs> do you know how to do this? Yeah, of course. I don't believe you. Well, good. Good? Means you know when someone's lying to you, which is another valuable survival skill. So you did kill someone before? Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. You're right. Before all of this, I was sent to jail, you know? Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with something. Here. I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no. You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. feel good better i'm glad we have a plan and you're a good little shot thanks i guess we should see how far oh shit hold on everybody stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. <laughs> that thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This ain't shit. This. Yo! You keep screaming like that, and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. No, we're friendly. Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there, we won't let them escape. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. Of guys is what we need. 
they're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now? What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Hey, I'm not gonna bullshit you. Our group is a little fucked right now. We had a bite victim, then his mom took her life, and before that, just... It's okay. Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great! See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there, they're cool? Ben's young and stupid, and I think harmless. The first two things you said don't really go with the third. I know. We just have to keep an eye on him. No sweat. <laughs> it's been rough for everybody down there. I'm sure you could say the same. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. That tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. We can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Cool. That's about the only useful thing in here. It's empty. Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh, me? What? Am I gonna have to tell your people the plan or what? <laughs> Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes. Like I said, it's been a bit of a day. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we're not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. Maybe. So, yeah. Hi. Uh, again? You all want some candy? The plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want to start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute. If you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works in case something happens? Really, Kim? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. You interrogating this woman for us? Yep. She set off any alarm bells? Not yet. She's very thorough. That's what I like to hear. Hey there. That's a pretty useful radio for her to be holding on to, no? It's busted, but it means something to her. Oh, I understand. sure how we'll get that tank down. Maybe ask me. He likes to break things. Careful. She's a crack shot now. You got this girl shooting guns? Look, I don't need a lecture. You weren't getting one. It's good. She should be able to take care of herself. Where are you from? <clears throat> San Francisco. Jeez, a long way from home. I blame the one in there. He wanted the great American road trip. Well, he got a little more than he bargained for, huh? Who the hell is into Civil War history anyway, other than old white guys? Wonderful. You two will be thick as thieves. Look 
create one hell of a fireball if we tried to blast through. I'm glad someone's managed to keep the spear. You like Civil War history, huh? Fuck yeah. What do you know about some Quantrill's Ray? Well, it happened about a thousand miles that way. Well, yeah. And we're headed the other way. But if it's somehow not crawling with the dead, there should be some cool things to see. Excellent. Don't tell Krista, though. That won't be as big a selling point for her. You got it. How long since you've been home? Like six months. We were on the road for a while, and then... Yeah. That's rough. Her cat is gonna be pissed. How have you two made it this far? You seem dangerously normal. Krista doesn't let us join groups. And I'm a fucking scrapper. I got the feeling she takes care of you. Please. I've saved her ass hundreds. Tens. Sometimes. Learning the ropes? Can't be too hard, right? There are a lot of levers I can't wait to use. I said if something were to happen to me, maybe we can drive it ships. We'll see. Talk to you later. Teaching him anything? I'm trying to. I don't know what that does yet. Don't touch it. I said don't touch it, jackass. The whole thing's pretty simple, really. How could it not be? Got a clear view up there? Yeah, we're good for a ways. Thank God. I need someone, anyone, to come along and, and exterminate them or something. Tough it up. It's you, me, and now Chuck. Who knows what these new people have planned? There are going to be a lot more walkers to take care of. That's what I'm afraid of. I'm telling you, Lee, if they ever get a hold of me, and I know I'm not getting out of it, that's it, man. I'm just gonna punch my own ticket. Punch your own ticket? Yeah. Take myself out. Don't be dramatic. And don't let them get a hold of you. I should check out that train station. Can I follow you over there? You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Somebody was doing some paint. Did 
you should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. The window's open up there. Maybe I could look in? Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. Ugh. Okay, I can see in. What do I do now? Uh, getting this door open is gonna be tough. It might not be that hard. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock. Which actually might work now that we have the I time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. Well, I'll be damned. You okay? Uh-huh. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. Mm. There's gotta be something useful in here. How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. some space up there, but not much. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. That's exactly what we need. Over there? Yeah, we need to get in there and get that blowtorch. It's locked up good, but there's some space at the top. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. They didn't have much business back then. How we doing? Good. What do we need? Something to help us deal with the tanker out there. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind you! Everything's fine. <laughs> Keys, down! So good. No, it did not go so good. But we're okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We found some walkers. 
You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? It was stupid. You think? What do you want me to say? I'm trying to teach her how to take care of herself. We're getting used to working together. I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. <clears throat> That's a good idea. I hope you know what you're doing with her. Me too. For her sake. now what did we learn i'm not ready for a gun we learned not to be afraid they should have got us but we got them yeah you're right fear is the thing that will kill us you understand Found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. Hi, girls. Hey. We were trying to get used to being on our own. Clementine and I. So you take her into a dark, boarded-up building to build character? Not exactly. I think it's a good idea, figuring stuff out for yourself, for what it's worth. But be smart about it, though, you know? Teach her to scan the area for things. You two should never be looking in the same spot. That's a waste. Stay the hell out of places like that building over there, especially if you don't have more than one way to get out. <laughs> be more afraid of groups of living men than dead folk. That we know. Omid and I are still alive because we're two, not six or eight or ten. I don't believe in strength in numbers, and you shouldn't either. This'll work? Dude, you're cutting metal with fire. How could it not? <laughs> Shit. What's up? The hose has a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that leak with something. Hope this holds. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Whoa. Thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. You can't reach it now. Here, the weak portion. 
portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no, but I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are! God, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. Yourself. I like his spot. We're fine, Clementine. We're fine. Next stop, the Atlantic. We have to find a boat. We just have to. We will. It's gotten too bad, you know. You, me, nobody can take all this. But we have. What we're supposed to do isn't clear anymore. I'd give anything to go back to fighting over the motel. <sighs> Me too. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. <laughs> Savannah Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I did. Holy shit. I thought that fucking thing was broken. So did I. Well, sounds like somebody knows where we're headed. Oh, 
the fuck? I don't know, but I doubt we're gonna be happy when we find out. at the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? We need to focus on finding the boat right now, Claire. Like we talked about on the train. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. <clears throat> if his leg gets any worse, we're gonna have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street. Now! Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you. You understand? I will kill you! 